Welcome to another episode of Franchise Friday. In this episode here, I'm going to compare fish sandwiches from McDonald's, Popeyes, Wendy's, and Arby's. And I'm gonna pick the winner. Stay tuned. It's a damn shame what they did to that sign. Alright, it's that time of the year again where, you know, some of these places roll out limited edition, or limited edition, limited time, like fish sandwiches. Chick-fil-A did it, I believe, last year. Uh, Popeye's does it. Wendy's does it. Um, and, you know, McDonald's always has a filet of fish in the menu, so I got that too. So, and Arby's, Arby's got something called the Hawaiian fish sandwich. I told you, Arby's low-key is actually kind of killing the game. They really are. Let me do the Popeye's one since I got that one first. All right, so this is the flounder. All right, comes in this. Do what Popeye's is talking about. All right. Today is windy. Hold on, let me put some lotions on my hand. Hold on, y'all not, y'all not, y'all ain't about to roast me on here. Okay. Good bread, yo. It is so windy outside. Let's show y'all. This looks good. That signature like Popeye sauce. I got the spicy one. So it looks like, let's look at the bottom. Any pickles, any cheese? Two slices of pickle. I am mad at that. It looks good. This is, here we go. Got a good spice. I swear they use the same bread too for, for their chicken sandwich. Collapses really well. Nice and soft. Mm. This is a good start. This definitely has like a Popeye signature sauce flavor really good I like it flaky the only thing it wasn't as crunchy but then again, it's been sitting for a good 10, 15 minutes because I had to drive around to get the other stuff. Popeye's spicy flounder. That was good. <laughs> that was good. Uh, up next, let's do Wendy's. Yeah, we're going to get right into it. Wendy's here. This is a limited, uh, this is a seasonal item right here. They don't really have this. This is wild caught Alaskan fish. This is the Wendy's version. This has like the panko crust, which is like, uh, to me panko, I associate that with a little bit more crunchier texture. Like the Popeye's one was good, but didn't have no crunch. So I'm, I'm anticipating a, a better crunch here from Wendy's. That looks good. Sorry for the lighting, y'all. Hey, Wendy's, let's, let's, let's inspect this real quick, top to bottom. All right, so this has cheese. This has lettuce. Cheese is somewhat, uh, not melted all the way, but it's cool. See that? That is Wendy's. Definitely looks more crustier. It's gonna be a better crunch. They gotta melt that cheese a little bit better. Let's go. Wendy's wild caught Alaskan, whatever, fish sandwich. There go, oh, there's pickles in here. I didn't even see it. Okay, okay, okay. Mm. The spicy um, flounder was saucier. This isn't as saucy. This has like that nice soft bread action, the pickles, nice crunch from the lettuce. 
and from the panko. I can't really, I mean the fish right now is just, there's not enough fish flavor on the uh, Wendy's. It's good, crunch wise, but the flounder, I can actually taste the flounder better on this one. I can taste the flounder better on the uh, Popeyes one. Yeah, this is all texture to me and cheese. It's good, but we'll see. Definitely has better texture. This has better crunch. Popeyes has better flavors. Let's move on. Arby's. Arby's, here we go, Arby's. Arby's might be the underdog here. They might come through though. Arby's rarely disappoint me. I don't know why, Arby's really good. This is the Fish Deluxe Hawaiian. Let me know how that looks for y'all. I don't really see it yet. Ooh, that melted cheese is, is, it looks struggling. Definitely melted more than the other one. Uh, so this got lettuce, tomatoes. Let's do the inspection here. Okay. And mayo, flip it around. More mayo on the bottom. Lettuce, tomatoes. No pickles. Yo, what's up with onions? Like, people really don't like onions like that? I was always, like, every time I eat my sandwiches, it gotta be LTO, lettuce, tomato, onions. Y'all really against onions like that? I need my onions in my sandwich. Onions just add, like, a like nice bite to it. Okay. Arby's. Hawaiian Deluxe. Mmm. Mmm. Really good bread. Nice filet. I like the tomatoes in here. I wish they had, um, I wish this had pickles. I don't even know why they call it the Hawaiian. I don't see, like, every time I hear Hawaiian, I think of, like, uh, pineapple. This is, like, a hybrid of, I taste the fish more. The fish is good. But it has a crunch, too. So it has, like, the crunch of the panko from the Wendy's, but it has, like, a fish flavor. There's a sweetness here. Must be tartar sauce or something. I don't know. It's getting close. It is getting close. I didn't want to do McDonald's because McDonald's is so like nothing special about it, but I'll do it anyways for y'all in case y'all never had it. But I've had this plenty of times. I'm pretty sure you guys have. I might as well show it to y'all. Good old dependable filet fish gonna be a smaller patty see some tartar sauce that's it look at it <laughs> this is literally like they put is, is this how the cheese is made in McDonald's they really said we're just gonna give you a landing strip of cheese I could have sworn McDonald's cheese used to cover the whole bottom that's sad I don't even want to bite into it but I'm gonna just do it for nostalgic purposes One hit a quitter, one bite, I'm done with you. It's, it's safe to say the McDonald's one is last place. Third place. Third place, I'm gonna give it to Wendy's. All right, who's gonna be second and who's gonna be number one? Let me try it again. 
Let me try one more bite. This is the uh, Popeye's one. Look at that. It's a big patty. Second place. Second place goes to Popeye's, which means Arby's fish sandwich is number one in this showdown. Yeah. Close one and two. I honestly feel like Wendy's could have had a chance. Um, but I felt like that, that fish patty could have... I've had it before. I ain't go front. I had the, the Wendy's panko before. So I guess it all depends. You know what I mean? This could have been... That McDonald's definitely number four. That is that is last place. That that didn't stand a chance. But I felt like depending on which location you go to, the Wendy's could have been on top. I was rooting for the Wendy's one because I've had it before. I'm like, oh, this is some good stuff. Nice and crunchy and good flavors. The fish sandwich showdown. The crown goes to Arby's. Bonus coverage. Because y'all here with me and I love y'all so much. We're going to do Popeye's uh, cream cheese pie. Which one is this one? This thing is smacking, smackaroo. Oh, look at that thing. I don't want this to fall. Look at that. This is like a cinnamon, like, pie. I don't even know. He just said, I just, I had it before. I'm like, yes, I definitely want that. He's like, do you want two for two for $3 for the cinnamon something pie? I'm like, yes, let me get that. Ooh, oh, apple, cinnamon, apple pie. Ooh. Ooh. Mm. They keep it nice and warm and toasty for y'all. All right, so Arby's won, but can't nobody even even McDonald's um McDonald's apple pie ain't touching this, and even Jolly Bees. I've had Jolly Bees, you know, they, they, uh, what do you call it? The apple pies too, or they pies, the mango pie. It's just good. It is very good. But the Popeyes one is, uh, way better. Way better. Trust. Mm. It's like eating a cinnamon toast crunch. The adult version. You know what I mean? So good. Best way to top it off. Yo, thank you for joining me again. This was fun to do. Um, again, drop your recommendation, your suggestions on where to go. Small, small mom and pop shops or any new items on the menu I should try too from these fast food joints. Other than that, I'm out of here. Y'all be safe. Y'all take care. I'll see you on the next episode. Peace. Best way to top it off. Yo, thank you for joining me again. This was fun to do. Um, again, drop your recommendation, your suggestions on where to go. Small, small mom and pop shops or any new items on the menu I should try too from these fast food joints. Other than that, I'm out of here. Y'all be safe. Y'all take care. I'll see you on the next episode. Peace.